A man has been arrested on suspicion of murdering a missing woman who vanished nearly 10 years ago. Claire Holland was 32 when she was last seen leaving a pub in Bristol city centre in June 2012, with police then launching a renewed operation last November. Locations in and around the city were searched, and a new appeal for help to solve the cold case was put out to the public. Eerie CCTV footage of Claire was also released. Now, Avon and Somerset police have said a 40-year-old man has been arrested in relation to the investigation. Mum Claire, from Lawrence Weston, left the Seamus O'Donnell's pub in St. Nicholas Street at around 11.15 p.m. on Wednesday, June 6, 2012. Claire Holland went missing in 2012. She was subsequently reported missing several days later, police said. Detectives leading the inquiry carried out a significant police operation in connection with Claire's disappearance last November, with searches conducted in a number of locations across Bristol, a statement continued. A renewed appeal, featuring CCTV footage from the day Claire disappeared, was also released by the major crime investigation team, who asked for anyone with information that could help them to come forward, they added. Police released CCTV of Claire on the night of her disappearance. They said, We are continuing to provide support and updates to Claire's family and we'd ask for their privacy to be respected at this time. In 2019, a man aged 37 at the time was arrested but released under investigation. Police have confirmed the same man has been re-arrested today. Last November, Claire's mom, sister and daughter spoke of their heartbreak at not knowing what happened to her. What crimes have been reported in your neighborhood? Check within your area. Her daughter Rosie, who was just a nine-year-old at the time her mom disappeared, spoke of how she was inspired to excel in athletics and now football, she is on the books of Bristol Rovers, in honor of her missing mom. Their interview came as police launched their major operation. Officers also contacted every single person who was friends on Facebook with Claire.